And this is what everybody normally sees. And we'll walk over here to the uh, apparel. We're not a big apparel shop, so don't expect uh, a lot of apparel. We just carry enough to, uh, for people to get by. Cali, we are the Cali distributors in Canada. Cali helmets, 2.1 pound, I believe, carbon fiber one. And we also do the, uh, the V-tunes, the bell helmets. We have GPS. Uh, we have some uh, pants just hanging on the rack. Like I said, we're not a big apparel dealer, so uh, don't expect much here. And we have the whole bell display, so we are a big bell helmet reseller. And of course, goggles. And here we have a lounge where there's my kids, that's Amy and that's Daniel. And uh, they're watching uh, some sort of show on Teletoon, I guess. There's a lounge so people can relax. It's got two big orange KTM couches. And they could play and relax, and you could bring your kids here and walk, buy some motorcycle parts and let leave them here. We'll take a tour inside the shop here. This is our shipping area. There's these are orders that have to go out. This is our shipping tables, envelopes, of course. We've got some boxes down there. And these are, this is our shipping rack. All these blue bins represent an order that corresponds with orders on that wall and this wall here. And this is our tables to break down our, our packages when we come in. And that's our shipping computer. And that's our fridge. And I promise you, if you ever come here and ask, I do have beer. And that's proof. And we have a service area, which is a different building altogether. We cut a hole through the roof, hole through the roof, hole through the wall. I mean, so right there. We put a door in way, and now we're in a not a building altogether. These are our customers' bikes. Some of them are uh, not the best condition, but you know they still want to keep riding them, so they bring them here, and we keep them going. And those, I believe, are uh, getting ready to work on. Uh, these ones here are being worked on. So we have a, this has got an RM250 all stripped apart. Looks like it's actually being put back together. It looks like it's all done. Because I saw this one last week and, uh, and the head was removed, the cylinder was removed. So it looks like it's all back together and it's going back together. And this one, yeah, this one here for sure was definitely stripped right apart to nothing. So this bike here is actually a customer bike the air filter and it's uh, ready to go. Whole motor's back together, whole bike's back together. And this is a KX100. Uh, this is my, this is Lori's bull bike. She used to race this thing, now she's got a, a YZ125. And it's a new top end, looks like it. Taken apart. It's our oil that we use for oil changes. We pull them out of that big barrel. And back there, just more inventory and stock. Yeah, this is my inventory in stock, and we got more shelving for oils and body kits, and we got big boxes there. Uh, Cali helmets, more of the oils. Uh, all the stuff is the skid plates on the bottom, plus the flatland rag guards and skid plates. More flatland stuff. We'll see the hand guards, the hide racing product we just started carrying, all plastic stuff. A uh, whole flat of a uh, DID chains and over there we got more this is a scorpion racing line we got a whole line of uh, skid plates and so this area here customers don't really see so I mean I apologize if this is kind of messy right now but we took it back from the bike show this is one of our show bikes here it's a YZ250 and these are our boxes that we haven't broken down yet uh, these are we do recycle used tires so customers can bring tires back and we could uh, recycle them for you. So this is a pile of recycled tires which they pick up uh, once every two weeks. So this is about probably where they get pick up. And these are new tires. This is more overstock. These are the Dunlops, more Dunlops. And over there, Michelin's. And a skid of uh, tubes, like IRC tubes. And at the end there is a skid of arrows, I believe. I don't know what those are, but. And air filters and more helmets. And this is my uh, my personal bike. 
the KTM 530 that I've been uh, riding for a couple of years now. This is getting a little tired, so I'll probably get a, end up getting a new bike this year. Uh, don't know what I'm going to get yet. I'm kind of playing a few models, so uh, we'll see. I hope you enjoy this uh, tour of the shop. And there is more to it, but it's just office and stuff. You don't really want to see that office in the lunchroom and all. So I'll leave it to you.